Hi guys, welcome to the RP Resonance Chemistry. Now let us continue our lectures on electrochemistry. Today we are going to deal with uh, thermodynamic relations uh, regarding to the our EMF value, the thermodynamic relations, the thermodynamic terms which is related to the our electrode potential EMF values. Okay. Simply, the first of all, we are going to the topic that is a uh, thermodynamic relations. In particularly, first of all, the relation between EMF and free energy. Relation between EMF and free energy. So this is the first uh, first one. Later on, we have discussed many of the other relations. Okay. Now here in this case, the free energy simply free energy and uh, EMF value. Free energy is nothing but delta G. So simply, so a cell, an electrical cell, which produces uh, some current, which produces some current. That current can be used to run a motor. Simply, it is a uh, to uh, to do work, any work. Simply, for instance, uh, to run a motor. Okay. But uh, thermodynamic uh, applications can be employed a relation between electrical energy and electrical energy and uh, like a maximum amount of work done maximum amount of work done which is obtainable from the like cell which is obtainable from the cell so here it is a maximum amount of work done so they are uh, derived a relation between the electrical energy and the maximum amount of work done so the maximum amount of work done which is related to the thermodynamic term so emf electrical energy which is related to the our uh, the, like uh, our electrochemical term okay so here it is the thermodynamic term so according to them according to them so maximum amount of work done that that is which is obtainable from the cell which is uh, directly simply which is a directly proportional to the the product of the product of flow charge of the flowing current per mole charge of the flowing current per mole so simply charge of the flowing current per mole into like a, their potential difference maximum potential difference and not only simple potential difference so the maximum potential difference okay so, so this which is nothing but work done work maximum work done which is obtainable from the cell so that is nothing but w maximum so always it is a negative value always it gives the negative value so the charge flow of the current that is a number of moles uh, uh, in a uh, like a uh, charge of the electrons that means a uh, faraday of your electricity this is the like a uh, flow of the current okay flow of the current now here the how many number of moles are involved so that is the number of moles into uh, uh, flow of the electrons which is uh, uh, termed as a uh, for uh, like a uh, faraday's now the maximum potential difference that is nothing but e cell so that is nothing but e cell this is the w maximum which is equal to the minus n f e cell minus n f e cell this is the first relation again according to the thermodynamic relations the maximum work done that is free energy according to thermodynamic equation so free energy which is equal to the so the total uh, simply uh, work done maximum simply which is equal to the work done maximum that is nothing but delta g is equal to w maximum so this is the first equation which is from the cell obtainable from the cell so now the second equation which is obtainable from the thermodynamic so now let, uh, let us compare one and two equations from one and two equations uh, Okay, now delta G is equal to minus N of E cell. So this is the best method to uh, count the like free energy calculations uh, over than the other uh, titration methods, other titration method. Now, however, here it is a uh, delta G is equal to minus N of E cell. Delta G is equal to minus N of E cell. So which is uh, like uh, interlinked to the Gibbs Helmholtz equation. So now which is interlinked to the Gibbs Helmholtz equation. Okay, now the Gibbs Helmholtz equation is equal to minus delta G is equal to minus delta G delta H minus T into rho of dou G by dou T at a constant pressure. At constant pressure. This is called a Gibbs Helmholtz equation. Those those type of relations which are available in our uh, thermodynamic relations, don't bother about those re equations. Okay, now here minus delta G is equal to minus delta H minus T into dou dz by dou t at constant pressure. Now let us substitute those delta g values over there. So if delta g is equal to minus nf e cell, then minus delta g is equal to what about the minus delta h? So nf e naught cell. So simply it is nf e naught cell. Now here, if delta g naught, if it is the standard value, then we, our value also standard. Okay. Now nf e cell minus simply here it is the minus delta h minus t into dou by dou t into here delta g value is minus nf e cell minus nf e cell at a constant pressure okay now here nf e cell 
is equal to minus delta h minus delta h here minus into minus that is plus value here t is a temperature is constant a number of moles also constant uh, the faraday of electricity throughout the reaction is constant now here n of t is constant uh, then the remaining thing is dou e by dou t at constant pressure dou e by dou t at constant pressure dou e is nothing but dou e cell okay now it's it is a equation but we are required uh, simply it is a electrode potential value emf value particular emf value okay now we need emf value here nf is uh, additional and additional one so that's why the total equation which is divided by the nf so now let us assume here it is the like i think it is the fourth equation so it may be third equation so the fourth equation four can be divided can be divided by nf okay now e cell here nf nf cancelled nf nf cancelled okay so now e cell is uh, left out now minus delta h by nf now here also nf nf cancelled so let us assume here nf nf cancelled so the remaining thing is t t into do e by do e cell by do t at constant pressure do e cell by do t at constant this is the emf with a like a free energy relation emf with free energy relation so simply here do e cell by do t which is called as like a temperature coefficient temperature coefficient so which is used for the determination of like electrical energy which is lesser than the heat of energy or greater than the heat of energy or equal to the heat of energy okay now here based on the temperature coefficient we are observed three cases that is either equal to the electrical energy either equal to the like heat of energy or it is higher than the heat of energy or lower than the heat of energy three cases are arrived three cases are arrived now let us discuss those three cases Okay, now the uh, three cases: the case one, case two, case three, case one, case two, case three. Let us assume here it is the three cases. That means a uh, temperature coefficient is equal to the zero. Temperature coefficient is positive value. Temperature coefficient is uh, like a negative value. So this is the negative value. So that means dou e by dou t is equal to the zero. So let us assume at constant pressure. So dou e by dou t is equal to zero. Zero into temperature that is zero value. So then E cell is equal to minus delta H. Okay. Simply here N F E cell is equal to minus delta H. Simply it is the relation which is obtainable from the like whenever the dou e by dou t is equal to zero. Now we will get the uh, simply N F E cell which is equal to the minus delta H. Now, in similarly, if dou e by dou t is positive value, dou e by dou t at constant pressure is equal to positive value. That means it is greater than zero. Okay. Now we will get the value like this: N F E cell, N F E cell is greater than that of minus delta H. Is greater than that of minus delta H. Now here that is greater than indicates here the more and more, more and more. So excess of energy which is available from the surroundings. Okay. Now excess of energy. Uh, required from surroundings okay from surroundings okay now here whenever the excess of energy is required the temperature definitely it is fall down now in this second case temperature is fall down so maybe sometimes they are asking about uh, like those type of uh, like a theoretical basic question whenever dou e by dou t is a positive value what about temperature definitely temperature is fall down in similar case dou e by dou t is a negative value dou e by dou t is a negative value that means it's constant pressure so nf e cell is a definitely it is less than that of delta h now here excess of energy here it, the excess of energy which is obtainable from the cell so that is uh, uh, sent to the surroundings now here excess energy excess energy to surroundings now here which is avail which is uh, taken from the surroundings so now which is given to the surroundings given to the surroundings then these case temperature is raised temperature is raised these three cases are observed in case of uh, temperature coefficient values in case of temperature coefficient values now based on these the, these equations which are helpful for the relation between the emf and the free energy values now let us discuss the another important relations uh, uh, related to the our thermodynamic terms now uh, those are uh, very very important terms that is a delta s delta h delta g cp such type of values which are very helpful for predicting the some type of cells and their free energy calculations so now let us deal with some of the terms that is delta h delta g 
delta s and the cp values now here the standard values of delta h not delta g not delta s not that is the change in enthalpy change in free energy change in entropy that is a cp value heat content heat temperature at constant pressure okay now let us uh, start start with first one so that is delta g so we know that uh, according to our previous equation from the like our uh, free energy relation delta g is equal to minus n f e cell minus n f e cell if it is a, a standard value delta g not is equal to minus n f e cell e not cell is the standard so this is the first relation which is already available in our previous equation now the second one now we need the delta s not now we need the delta s not we don't know the relation between the delta s not with our electro emf values so which is uh, generally available from the thermodynamic square equation now here it is the square box of thermodynamics spvt okay here it is the square box so now here the arrows travel from uh, s to t p to v okay now here are some of the relations which are available h g a u okay h helps uh, enthalpy gives free energy helm holds free energy internal energy okay now any type of relations uh, which is uh, if if you need uh, this delta g so those uh, adjacent terms are written like dp and dt okay now again so if you need dg so dp and uh, sorry dp and dt is available okay now before that uh, before that uh, so which term which is traveled to to which term now p is traveled to v so that's why it is vdp v d p now again uh, t is a travel to yes uh, okay now if p is a travel to v it's, uh, which is the right direction of uh, like a square box uh, that is arrow mark which, which is the correct direction not the opposite direction so if it is correct direction that is positive charge now in case of traveling of t to yes it is opposite direction that is the negative charge okay this is the like a relation one so delta g is equal to v d p minus s d t okay at constant pressure delta g is equal to minus s d p at constant pressure uh, minus uh, that is that means here it is the zero so then minus s is equal to simply dg by dp okay dg by dt here not the p it is the t sorry so now here it is the t so dg by dt at constant pressure dg by dt at constant pressure so in case of uh, minus delta s that is a uh, dou of dou g by dou t at constant pressure so this is the uh, one relation which is available from the thermodynamic square box so those value which is a uh, uh, those value we will substitute those value based on the our above equation so now here minus delta s is equal to dou of dou g by dou t dou of dou g by dou t at constant pressure let us substitute the dou g, dou g value over there so the, if delta s not is there it is the dg not okay now here dou of dg not is equal to uh, simply here it is minus n of e cell e cell that is a potential value here dou t okay now minus charge uh, shifted to the right side that means uh, here minus delta s no no more uh, shifting now minus nf is constant value dou e cell by dou t okay here negative negative cancelled so the final equation is delta s is equal to nf dou e cell by dou e standard cell by dou t so this is the second equation that is delta s value that is the second equation that is nothing but the delta s value now the third equation we know that cp okay now let us find the cp relation okay cp is nothing but cp is equal to delta h by dt simply dg dh by dt or delta h by dt okay now we know that another similar equation so if you need the dh then let us substitute those equation delta h is equal to ds and dp is there s travel to the t t ds now p travel to the v that is vdp so both are in opposite uh, same direction that's why both are positive values both are positive values and similarly at constant present delta h is equal to tds that delta h is equal to tds now let us substitute those value over there cp is equal to tds by dt tds by dt. Uh, delta h is equal to tds okay now let us substitute those uh, those as ds value cp is equal to t into d by dt into so s value that is nothing but n of okay do e not cell by do t do e not cell by do t now let us uh, let us keep the constant values uh, be before the derivation n of t now do into do do square do t into do t do t square so here it is the e cell value e cell value so this is the cp relation this is the cp relation now in similarly so the third relation that is nothing but a, a delta h relation we know that the delta h relation now let us derive the third relation that is nothing but a delta h we know that delta g is equal to dh minus tds is it right or wrong so this is the un, uh, un, uh, it is a very familiar equation now in case of delta h that is equal to the delta g plus tds delta g plus tds now let us substitute those values if delta g is equal to minus n f e cell 
minus nf is a in case of all our standard values plus t into ds value that is n of do e not sell by do t do e not sell by do t okay now here simply uh, the positive values uh, keep the right side now n of t is constant value do e not sell by do t okay this is the positive value then negative value is n of e not sell so if both the, both the terms uh, nf is common that's why i keep the uh, kept the constant values of nf then the remaining things are do e not by do t do e not by do t minus e not cell minus e not cell so this is the like a uh, delta h not equation delta h not equation okay so now these are the four important terms uh, which is related to the our uh, uh, thermodynamical quantities which is related to the our terms that is nothing but uh, simply our uh, electro emf value terms so now the four are uh, very important delta g is equal to minus nf e cell okay now in case of the delta s is equal to nf do e not sell by do t so this is the very uh, very important topic important relation so many of the previous year gate questions and 2020 bulk questions are came from the this equation only 2020 bulk okay now the third one is uh, like our cp cp is equal to nf t into do square e naught cell by do t square okay which is also available so which is the previous year differ question is there previous year differ question is there now the fourth relation that is delta h naught so delta h is equal to nf into t do e naught cell by do t minus e naught cell minus e naught cell so these four are the very important relations now i think it is very helpful for predicting the emf value of uh, our uh, general cell reactions okay that's all for this video this is very helpful for you thank you so much for watching